she moved Jabour out of the way to give herself that room. Let's see how much more she does of that. Movement is an issue, perhaps, for Jabour, but then again, she can make up for it with all sorts of uh, guile and craft like that. Just ambles forward. She's got it all under control there. You know they're coming. It's just a matter of if you can just anticipate and run them down. A sweet two-hander into the corner, and that does for the first game. Pretty to watch, isn't it? <laughs> isn't it? Unless you're Muguruza. Well, look how much court Muguruza had to cover. <laughs> Remember, and she hadn't ever beaten Svitolina before, had she? So that was a real breakthrough. That you know, one's been in the top ten out of it and found her way back, and the other one's fighting to get into the top ten for the first time. Of good stories, they really are. Krachikova, I mean, coming out of nowhere, uh, really, in terms of this. Well, she had to have two goes at it that angle and still kept producing it. What a shot to finish it. Her signature shot closes the first set. Clever. This time, not just going back and cross, but back up the line that time. Yeah, Muguruza just wanted to keep running to her left, didn't she? Just completely uh, perplexed. Important to play each ball on its merits. Well, she won the point, but it wasn't straightforward, was it? No. To break point on the Jabur serve. Well, managing to uh, make a, a strong response now. But totally outplayed there by Jabur. Brilliant. Back it comes. What a counter from Jabur. Scintillating shot this was from the Tunisian. Look at this anticipation from Jabur. She had a pretty good idea that Muguruza was going to hit that swinging volley. And there's the response. She was there waiting. She does. Oh. 
again. The second seed does get back on track in this second set. What an angle. For the third match in succession between these two, they go the distance. Muguruza fighting hard with all she's got, and it proved just enough there to overturn Jabur and take them the distance. Backhand volley was never going to be good enough. That's easy pickings for Muguruza. And that is a real spear through the defence there, just attacking the ball. One of her biggest serves. And again, that point set up by an excellent first serve. And the confidence at the other end is evaporating mm -hmm. like the rain off the court. What an angle. That was amazing touch there from the tall Spaniard. One too many times to the well. Yeah. It's Muguruza's title, champion in Chicago, her second trophy of the season. And she's come all the way back to beat the Tunisian. That's what they keep doing. You lose the first set, but you win the match. That's happened every time they've played. And this time, Muguruza overturning Jabeur in three sets. And uh, she finished it in a sprint. 3-6, six, 6-3. Six, Six left. Full credit to Gabini Muguruza in this match. She was completely outplayed in the first. May I present to you, Chicago, your 2021 Chicago Fall Tennis Classic champion, Gabini Muguruza. So there she is, Gabini Muguruza, the champion in Chicago.